That's one point in two games in the JD Welsh Premier League for the New Saints. Perfect opportunity to bounce back against Carnarvon Town. Yeah, it's going to be another tough test against Carnarvon. Um, we beat them 3-0 at their place. Yeah, but it was a real tough game, so we're expecting. But that, that's what you need. You need to be pushed. You need um, teams to come out and play against you, which they did. And um, yeah, as you say, it's a, a good chance to bounce back. It's the good thing in football. You get a chance to make things right. It was a very tough game indeed, and you pulled off more than one incredible save to keep the New Saints in the game, especially in the first half. Expecting the same type of intensity this time round. Yeah, definitely. They're a good team. They're, they're set up well. Uh, they've got a lot of pace in the team, so they're set up to you know soak up a lot of pressure and trying to uh, play on the counter. So yeah, expecting another tough game, but as I say, it's um, one that we're all looking forward to after the last result. Carnarvon have slipped away somewhat in the league. They're actually closer to the relegation places now than the top. But nevertheless, it's always important to give each side full respect going into the game, I guess. Yeah, definitely. I think it proves it, doesn't it? Every team that we seem to play against seems to rise up to the challenge. And, you know, I think I heard Scotty saying the other day, we're a big scalp to a lot of people. And obviously teams rise, don't they? And they, um, they improve against us. And, you know, it's a big thing to beat us, as you've seen after the result the other day, you know, the way they were celebrating the win. So, you know, we've got to, we've got to cope with that. We've got to be better at coping with that. And um, as I say, we won't look where they are now. We know they're a tough team to play against and, you know, they'll get respect off us, but not too much where we won't stamp our own game on them. We've lost three times so far in the Welsh Premier League this season. Having said that, two of the games have been by the slenderest of margins, just 1-0. Yeah, just 1-0, but that's, it's, that's what's so disappointing because we're a goal-scoring team and, you know, it's not just down to the lads up front or anything. As a team, you know, we have goals all over the pitch. So it's disappointing to lose by, as I say, like slender margins, but I say we'll, we'll put it right, we'll find our feet. You know, it's, there's a, it's a lot of new lads in the team as well, so you've got to give them time to adjust as well. So, as I say, we'll find our feet and I'm sure, you know, we'll be back where we need to be. You're an experienced player, also been at the New Saints a good number of seasons. So in many ways, this blip, if we can call it that, is nothing new to you. No, it's nothing new. You know, in previous years, I don't think we've ever been the greatest of starters to a league. Uh, a league. Um, but as I say, you know, it's teams are rising up to the games that we're, we're playing against them. They've got a way of playing against us, which upsets us a bit. Um, we've got to be better at dealing with the challenges that are in front and we need to enjoy the challenge that, uh, that they give to us and um, not get our heads down, not think, you know, just get on with the game and I, I say, I know for a fact we've got the players in there that are going to do it. And as the captain of the side, how important is your role in a situation like this? Yeah, it's important. Yeah, I'm not, I wouldn't say I'm the most vocal person in the world, but I try and do things right day to day and you know, lead by example on the pitch and as I say I think everyone in there um, has got their own personalities and we just need to be honest with each other now and try and get ourselves through which is I say a bit of a blip but you know we'll, we'll be fine we'll do we'll be back I'm sure. And when we look at the results there does seem to be a difference between Park Hall and on the road we've been very successful at home we've scored six goals on three occasions Having said that, all the defeats have come away from Park Hall. Yeah, I say I think I think that's down to as we've said before, as I said before, I think teams you know show up for it um, at their own their own place. And um, there's a few difficult grounds to go to. Um, I think teams set up different at home as they, than they do when they come here. I think a lot of teams come here knowing our record here, which has always been good. So I think a lot of teams have got it mentally that it's going to be a tough game before they get here. We're at home, I think they see we've had a bit of a tough start to the season. I think they, they fancy what their place because they're at home, they're going to get in our faces, give us a tough time. But we've got to be better at dealing with it, we know that. Um, and I think we will, we'll, we'll find our feet soon enough. And as I say, once it, once it starts clicking, I'm sure the results will start coming.